Hi again, Doug here from X Frames FPV, and today I've got another motor test for you. This is of the Hyperlite V3 2206 2300 kV motor, and I absolutely love these motors. and And for a few reasons, you know, one is it it is a nice and light motor. It is a very powerful motor for um, the size, and and 2300 kV is is kind of the baseline, really, what we use in in quad racing. Sometimes people, you know, will go up to 2600 or, you know, even higher on um, some of the builds. And um, we're talking about five inch here. But, you know, I really like these motors because they're very consistent. I have used numerous of these motors and they always are really well balanced really nice and quiet when i when i spin them up in clean flight and look at the look at the uh, graph and see what they're doing and um so i i have had these like i said on on quite a few of my own builds i actually have them on two of my builds right now and get an idea of kind of And I really do like these motors. Windings are really nice and tight. Curved magnets. Let's see if we can get a... You can see how tight that to the tolerance is in there. The stator between the stator and the magnet. So um, I, I have a lot of experience as far as flying these motors, as far as putting them in builds, you know. This is from Surge over at PyroFlipRC.com. And Hyperlite is his race series. So he has some ESCs, obviously some motors, and the Hyperlite frame, which is a stretched X frame and is one of my favorite frames, if not my favorite favorite frame. And I'm his builder. I do build. He has a ready-to-race version over there, and I do build those for him. But um, these motors are just smooth, fast, and so I'm excited to get them on the test and on the thrust test and get an idea of how much power and how efficient they are, okay? So I'll be back with you. Dell T5045 Blunt Triprop. Dowell fifty forty quad prop. Racecraft fifty forty five tri prop. Spinning a Dowell TJ5045 triprop. All right, we're back. So what do you guys think? I, th I thought that this put up some pretty decent numbers. Um, let's, let's do a little bit of measuring here. On the can, we got 27, just a little bit, a bit above 27. 18.50 and then on the winding right about 11.06 and these are a really smooth motor you know they're they're um the weight here 29 grams they're not the lightest they're not the fastest but they what they do is is they are a blend of all three of weight you know power and then also how smooth they are and how easy they are to tune and and how vibration free they are so that's these motors and we're going to do a couple more here in this series of tests and 
Um, I hope you guys are getting something out of these. You know, my main goal with these is to present them in kind of how they would be in the race drone field. So I'm going to be testing them. You know, most of these are all these would be done with a 75C tattoo battery. They're all going to have tri or quad props. And so um, I hope you guys are getting something out of it. I appreciate you guys a lot, and I hope you get some time to fly.